what's up you guys so i am back for another video I want to show you guys my makeup collection i was uh noticing my other makeup collection video i barely had anything i just had everything in this one um in this one bag and i was like oh wow like my makeup collection has grown a little bit so i kind of wanted to show you guys um so i wanted to show you guys everything in my makeup collection um at the moment i don't have like a vanity or anything to like really set it up on um i do have a vanity but it's like shared it's mine and my mom's so um once i have that of my own i will probably find like a better setup for my makeup but right now i just have it in this bag i have it in this bag and i have it in this bag uh just wing it life eyeliner everything that's what this bag says so cute i love it um yeah, so I, and then I also have like my everyday makeup, but I, I, um, said it in the video that I just made that I'm waiting to get a new makeup bag, but I think I'm actually going to just put it in here. Um, I got this bag not that long ago. I just didn't use it because I felt like it was too big. Um, it's like a really big bag compared, um, like it's like, these are like, this one's like a little bit bigger than this one um but it is a little bit thinner so i'm gonna try it again um i had like a bunch of stuff in here before and i had it in my purse but i was also carrying a smaller purse at the time so i just took it out um but now i have a little bit of a bigger purse so we'll try it um but yeah so now my makeup collection includes this bag um but yeah, you guys, so just wanted to show y'all, let me fix this hair, because she's going nuts. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to show you guys what I have in my makeup bag. Again, this hair. Okay. <laughs> like, take three. <laughs> I just wanted to show you guys what I have in my makeup bags and show you how much my makeup collection has grown. So let's do that. <laughs> but this is like literally what I need for every single day. Um, if I just have these, I'm good. I don't even really necessarily need these other bags. These other bags are more just like when I run out of something, I have other options or if I want to do anything like a little more dramatic than like this everyday makeup, I have the options. But um, so first and foremost, I just have this duo uh, lash, uh, lash glue and it is in a dark tone. So when you put it on, it's dark and so it doesn't like leave like a white line or anything um it's just i love this one i think it works so well um i have my little rosy lips um vaseline i have my rosy lips vaseline uh lip balm i have some lashes <laughs> i have this this is like my favorite lip color ever it is almond rose from maybelline ah. uh, almond rose number 132 i don't know if that makes a difference but that's what it says i have a, a little eyebrow shaper i have this elf um eyebrow pencil and it has the little spoolie on the side and then it has the color and it is in medium brown. I have this bedhead totally baked lip gloss um, at this at Dollar Tree. And um, most of my makeup, I either get it at Walmart um, 
or like can you know this and like the chapstick i think i got those at dollar tree but most of the time really every single time i get all of my makeup from walmart um there are some things that i've been able to find at um tj maxx and that's like that's really fun <laughs> but i don't always like frequent that place for my makeup um it's just easy to like go to walmart and get it uh sometimes i'll get stuff at ross i kind of get makeup from everywhere but majority of the time it's from walmart um especially the elf products uh so like i this <laughs> this liquid liner is from elf and it is in jet black i also have this uh elf uh eyeliner pencil in black and i have these two uh paris hilton uh mascaras this is i have both of them well no i have this voluminous one this is the one that i use the most but I have that one on right now. Um, I love the way that it does. It's magic. <laughs> um, it really does make my um, lashes like more voluminous, I guess. <laughs> you know, that's the name of the mascara. So it does its job. But uh, this is like the voluminous one. This is the lengthening one. And then I also have the curling one. Um, but these are the two that I really like. So that was the first makeup bag. That's like my everyday stuff. Um, this is my second part, the second part of my makeup bag. Um, and this is just mostly all of my brushes. Uh, I have this, uh, erase your face, uh, makeup, like cloth makeup wipe. I also have this little, um, I also have this little, uh, makeup brush cleaner. Um, you just put it like on your fingers and then clean your brushes. Um, I have all of these brushes. I have some that came in a set. Actually, most of them came in a set. And there's only like one or two that are just kind of random. Um, I have <clears throat> a little um, a little sharpener just in case. I have another uh, brow shaper. I have this little, this thing is useless to me. But this little thing that is supposed to help you put your lashes on. I think it's trash. I don't like it. It doesn't work for me. Um, I have another eyebrow shaper. Um, I don't know if you guys really care about my makeup brushes, but I thought I would just show them to you since they are part of my makeup collection. Um, I have these two little brushes. They're just like little fluffy brushes. And this is what they look like. They were from a Marilyn Monroe like gift set um, at the place that I worked at uh, when I got them oh, like several years ago already. Um, and they're really cute. These are the br <laughs> these are the brushes that I have the most of. Um, I want to say somebody gifted these to me. Um, remember i really can't remember to be honest i'll just show you guys really quick this is all the different kind of brushes and this is just like what they look like they're really nice they're really nice brushes um they are from bs mall it says bs dash mall bs mall I don't know. Um, yeah, so that's those. And then this is the same, same brand. It's just the bigger brushes. Yeah. Um, 
I don't get much use out of the brushes. As you guys know, I don't wear like foundation. I don't wear concealer. I don't wear bronzer. I don't really wear highlight. Like I don't really wear any of that stuff. But if I ever wanted to, I'm well brush prepared. <laughs> the only thing I don't have is a beauty blender, which is what most people use now regardless so i also have this little uh bamboo brush and um it just has like a little the little fluffy side and it has the little angle brush side i have honestly had this for years like years i can't even remember how long i've had it but i've had it for a really long time and i want to say that this also came in some kind of a gift set like that's usually how i get my brushes because i don't like actively make an effort to go buy brushes for my makeup because i normally i don't need them um and then i want to say somebody gave me this brush um and this just looks like this and it is an e.l.f. brush. It is an e.l.f. smudge brush. And I actually do use this. Um, I used to use it for my brows. I've used it to actually like smudge uh, <laughs> as it's supposed to do. I've used it for eyeliner. I've used it to pack on glitter. I've used it for everything. So it works, it works for me. Um, I got these makeup brushes for my birthday last year or the year before um i'm gonna say last year uh somebody at work gave me these I'm trying to put them in order of like how like big to small but this is just what they look like uh, they're really pretty brushes they are luxy brushes and then they tell you like on the sides exactly what they are so now on to the like actual makeup this is like all of my palettes and um anything that comes in like a little palette form i have it in here um i got this bag at tj maxx if you wanted to know so first things first i have this stila um blush and it is in the color Soft Glow. This is just what it looks like. Really cute. Honestly, though, but like if I put it on, you can't even tell. It's just like so, it's just like it's really light. And I am already like pretty white on my skin so it's just i don't feel like this would make much of a difference but yeah i have it um i have this moonstruck addiction uh shadow palette which was like the only palette i had for the longest time like i think you can even tell um, I don't use it as much anymore, but there's still some colors that I like to use, so I keep it around. I have this Revolution palette. Um, I got this at H-E-B, and I really like it. It works for me. It has some pretty good colors in it. Um, <laughs> uh, I have had this for an very singly long amount of time um this is a milani powder foundation in natural tan um there's nothing tan about this color but this is what it looks like and for the longest time i just used it for the mirror um i would sometimes use this as like a like a foundation or like a primer kind of thing um for my eyeshadow but now it's mostly just a mirror i have this that i have yet to use at all i bought it to use it as like a contour color um this is also from milani and it is in it's a con con 
concealer, I guess. Um, it's in Spiced Almond, and it was on clearance at H-E-B, and I was like, oh, that would be so perfect. Um, cream to Powder Foundation. This is just what it looks like. Um, yeah, I haven't really used it, because again, I don't really use, like, I think this is just going to be a video of, like, I don't really use this, I don't really use this, I don't really use it, but, like, I don't. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, so I also have this Ardell Sensual Eyes um, little quad. It's cute. I just don't, I don't really use much of it. If I do use them, I mostly use these two colors. Sometimes I'll use this one, but I definitely don't use that one. Um, I have this little uh, cream eyeshadow from Revlon. And it's just like a silver, it's a silver eyeshadow. I also have this Revlon um, Tickled Pink blush. Cute. I also have this Revlon Skin Lights Pris Prismatic Highlighter. And it is in the color Daybreak Glimmer is just what this looks like um i've used it as a highlighter sometimes but i mostly use this as an eyeshadow um i also have this proof is in the pudding um eye palette eyeshadow palette yeah this is what it looks like uh, and this was a gift as well as this one called the queen a queen lies in all of us and this is what it looks like. Cute, we love her. <sighs> this one is so exciting. Um, I got this, the Breakfast Club Saturday Detention Face Palette as a highlighter, a blush, and a bronzer. Um, I don't use them for that. I use them as eyeshadow colors, but um, this is just so stinking cute. Is that not the cutest thing ever? I could not pass it up whenever I saw it. So like, that's what it looks like right there. And then these are the actual colors. And then the color names are the brain, the princess, the athlete, the basket case, the rebel class of 84 so cute this is my Bratz palette I love it so much it is so cute and this is what it looks like and then the names on it are fashion pack Chloe Sasha Accessorize, Jade, Yasmin, Diamonds, OE Boys with a Z, important. Uh, passion, Fashion, Funky, Feeling Pretty, Tweevils, Tweevils, I guess. Uh, super Stylin', My Girls, Funk, funk Alicious. <laughs> Um, no, Funkalish, Funkalish, Halo, All Together, Convertible, Doll, Shopping Spree, Still, Stillsville, Midnight Dance, Bratitude, Magazine, Rock Angels, Pretty and Punk. So, and then look at that mirror. That is like the coolest thing ever. It's so big. Um, but yeah, and then it just has, of course, the Bratz on the front. And it is Bratz and Revolution. I want to make a video doing like a look with that palette, like a Bratz look. So watch out for that coming soon. And now on to this one. This is just what this one looks like on the inside. First thing I have in here is this little kit and it is like an eyebrow eyebrow kit it has like three different types of tweezers little scissors and then the little comb sorry 
I have a lash curler. Um, I can't remember where I got this, honestly. Probably from like Ross or something. Um, I have, oh, this is one of my favorites. New colors. Um, it's not a new color, but I tried it out because they didn't have any almond rose at the time when I went to the store to buy a lip liner. So I tried this color and it is in rich chocolate. It's so nice. I found the perfect combination for this color and it is this color like lining and like, you know, in here, like in the inner corners and then putting, um, like kind of like, you know, blending that in and then putting a pinkish, uh, oh, I just put it away, but putting like a pinkish eyeshadow in the middle and then uh, because I forgot my, I forgot this, uh, lip liner. I had, uh, I had the almond rose one, I think with me. And I went to, I went back to my purse after I got to work to like freshen up my, uh, my lip liner. And I, I forgot it, but I saw that I had my almond rose one in there. So I kind of filled it in. And it was still dark like on the outside but like i kind of filled it in a little bit more with the almond rose and then i i put that like baked um gloss that i have in like my everyday stuff my lips looked amazing i was very impressed um so next i have this doesn't have like any kind of uh writing on it or anything so i can't remember uh what the brand is but it just has this like felt tip side and then it has this stamp it's like a a liner eyeliner stamp and i got that as a gift um i haven't really used it oh sorry i'm getting like really uncomfortable sitting on the floor um i haven't really used it but whenever i need a backup i have it um, I have this little LA Colors setting spray. Um, I believe I got this at Dollar Tree. Um, you guys, if you've seen any of my videos, you know I have this little Wet n Wild foundation. I use this as a primer. Um, I've only used it once as like actual foundation. I have this um, Wet n Wild Mega Clear and i have used this on my lashes um it i feel like it somewhat helps um uh, make my lashes look a little bit i don't know like it helped it a little bit to make them look more full but it wasn't like a drastic difference but it was it was good you know um i have this uh Urban Decay Brow Endowed and has the primer on one side and then the color on the other side. Um, I bought this at TJ Maxx and I really like it actually. I just haven't used it in a while. Um, I have these little lip glosses. Uh, they're lip balms actually. And um, I bought these at TJ Maxx. <laughs> I bought these at TJ Maxx. I was dropping everything. Uh, one is in Strawberry. This one is in chocolate, this one is in blueberry, and this one is in, this one is in vanilla. Um, I think that they all smell really good, and I really like them. I feel like I always sound like I'm out of breath. <laughs> like, talking kind of takes a lot out of me, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. Um, so I have these little, uh, make, these little, like, lip scrubs that they made at work and one of the girls gave me uh gave me some of them they're supposed to be like a coffee a coffee one and it like smells like straight up coffee i still have to try them um and then i have uh these two lipsticks they are the part of the breakfast club 
makeup. I never got to get the actual eyeshadow palette. I was really sad about it, but I'm I'm good with the stuff that I did get. So um, this is, it just says the princess and then it says the breakfast club. And then this one is get real. This is the color get real. And this one is my favorite. I like this one the most. And then I also have this one in the color, the world is an imperfect place. Cause that's how he says it. <laughs> and this is the color. Going with the breakfast club things. I also have this um, mascara called detention mascara. And I haven't really, I've used it once because um, I used it for a video and it's called Ruckus Black or Noir. Um, and then that's just what the, that's just what the little brush looks like. I don't, <laughs> I don't even think that that matters, but I just thought I would show you anyways. Um, I have this little NYX matte lip liner. It is a suede matte lip liner and it is in the color Whipped Caviar. I also have this other NYX lip liner in the color Mauve. And I have this e.l.f. lip liner. Um, it doesn't have a name, but it's like a mauve color. And I like this one when I'm out of my Almond Rose one. Um, I have this brown uh, eyeliner pencil. I'll be very honest with you, I don't remember buying this. Like, not even in the slightest bit do I remember ever picking up a brown eyeliner pencil. But I have one, so there's that. Um, I have this satin eyeliner pencil it's an elf pencil um yeah it's just another one with the little uh sharpener at the top i also have this eyeshadow stick in like this navy blue color and it's from ardell i believe yeah it's called irresistible in the color slade from ardell and I also have two other, no, three other ones. Uh, this one is in the color Make It With You. This one is in the color Yearning. And this one is in the color Gun Metal. I still have yet to like really play around with these. I've tried, uh, I've tried one of them out and I will be honest, I don't love how it comes out, but I don't think that I've given them enough of a chance. So I might, uh, maybe I'll make a video trying to do like a makeup look with these colors. Um, yeah. And then I have this T-I-G-I -I Maui lip cream and i got this at the dollar tree and it just looks like this and you just twist it and then it comes out if you see that so yeah that's that one i have these lip oils that i love from the dollar tree and they are in a like rose scent. They're rose infused lip oil. Um, where did I get this? Oh, I got this from Dollar Tree. Um, I can't remember the brand, but it is a exfoliating, it's a lip exfoliator. Oh, it's a uh, Remy, Remy Rose is the brand. And it is a lip exfoliator. I have this Anastasia Beverly Hills uh, lipstick in Dread. It's a matte lipstick. I found this at TJ Maxx. 
and it's a good little color. I'll be honest, I don't use these very often, but I had found them at the Dollar Tree and it is just these three Milani uh, liquid lipsticks. And ooh, I'm sorry, you guys, I'm getting so uncomfortable sitting on the floor. Um, so this one is fluorescent light, definitely fluorescent. This one is in the color Desire. And this one is in the color Seduction. And last but certainly, certainly, I said certainly, certainly not least, I have this blue, <laughs> I have this blue liquid eyeliner from elf and i bought it when my hair was blue because i just felt like blue liner would go way better and i was right it went way better so i still have that um i have this extra um duo uh lash glue and then this is the curling mascara from paris hilton and that is everything you guys <laughs> I can only sit on the floor for so long and then I'm like an old lady trying to get up. Well, I hope you enjoyed that video. Um, I know it was kind of long, but I just wanted to show you guys what was in my makeup bag. I had been thinking about doing that video for a little bit, but then I was like, eh, no, I'm not going to do it. But then when I made that cleaning out my purse video, I was like, eh, I'm already here. My makeup's here. I might as well do it. So, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Remember to what? Repeat after me. Comment, like, subscribe, and all that stuff. So you can share this video with somebody that you think would like it. I would appreciate that. I share it with people that I think would like it. And we can grow together. I'm not trying to be like youtube famous or anything like that is not the goal for this channel the goal for this channel is just to have an outlet and it's to have something that i can connect with people that like the same things that i like because i don't find that very often with people that i'm actually around and so i want to put that out there that way i can bring in some people that actually like the things that i like too um but yeah so i just want to i want to start being consistent i want to start putting up content that is going to connect with people and that people are going to like um but also content that i really like and that i enjoy as well so i'm just trying to find like a good little balance there and yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed this video like i said for the thousandth time and i'll see you guys next time bye